This is a great daily cleanser that leaves your skin feeling so smooth and not stripped at all. It is gentle enough to be used every day and is the perfect partner for the cleansing balm from my previous video. All right, let's get straight into making this. Okay, so first heat your Olive M1000 along with some water and coconut oil. Don't worry, the coconut oil won't clog your pores as it will be fully rinsed off afterwards. Take a measure of your full beaker because water may evaporate during the heating process and you'll want to add that back in later. So now I'm heating it and in the meantime, measure glycerin and gum to make a slurry. I use Silly Gel in this case because it creates a nice texture. Another option would be a mix of guar and xanthan gum combined. I would not recommend just using xanthan gum because it gives this really gloopy texture. I'm not a fan. Once the mix with Olive M1000 melted completely, stir to combine into a cream. Once taken off the heat, remeasure the beaker and add water if necessary. Next, add your gum slurry to that and mix again. Once it has cooled off enough, add your ingredients from phase C. So add preservative and lactic acid. I also added some tea tree and grapefruit essential oils for a nice and fresh smell. Plus tea tree is a bonus for acne prone skin. Lastly, I added the cocoa glucoside. This is to support with the cleansing, so the combo of Olive M1000 with this surfactant would result in an effective but gentle product. Other great alternatives would be sodium steroil glutamate, decal glucoside, sucrose cocoate, and sodium cocoyl glutamate. Make sure not to stir too vigorously as it would get very bubbly with cocoa glucoside now in the mix. Measure your final pH, which turned out perfect for me. Again, it's a very basic product because I don't like to add all sorts of actives and botanicals to products I just washed down the drain. I just need it to be effective, gentle, and have a nice texture. Plus, it smells very nice. Now that we have cleansed, we will need to add moisture and oils back onto our skin. Next up, I will show you how Olive M1000 is great to make a soothing and hydrating oat cream. 